Hello everyone, my name is Edward Amwaku and I welcome you to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to make it so simple and short, yes, very short one. So and we're going to learn on how to design Happy New Month flyer like this. So amazing, very simple. So without wasting my time, let's start. Alright guys, so you're welcome. So this is the flyer that we are going to design. I mean, you can try this in the next month, which is coming November. You can try that. So for us to start with this particular design, don't forget that I will leave a link in the video description to have access to the resources. So let's create a new document. I go to file, new, click on and we are using for social media so let's name it as new month or um, october let me name it october new october and then we are setting it to 1080 and uh, height is also 1080 resolution 300 any other thing is okay we go ahead and click okay and here we go so we create our new background let's go to the resources i'm going to give you all the backgrounds that you need so we are bringing in this bring it to photoshop amazing then you enlarge it to fill the whole space okay just as this one you enlarge it to fill the whole space very simple then the next one that we are going to do is also to bring in another resources which i'm going to give it to you give you this one okay so let's bring down to photoshop as well okay so this one looks like a sky okay and then what we are going to do is to add a layer and then let's select our brush tool okay once you select you see the caps lock turn it off and let's increase the brush I think this is okay and then let's change the foreground color from black to white then just make a click like this which is okay so we are going to just leave it this way and then the next thing that we are going to do is to bring in this image which I'm going to give the image to you as well so this is the image okay let's bring it on to Photoshop absolutely amazing i'm going to resize it to this point i think this this is okay then we are going to bring in the logo so the logo i'm going to just copy it and then give it to you or better still you can just write your logo there but before we write the logo let me enlarge this okay before we write the logo i want us to start by going to text go and select our text to the font that i use for this particular tutorial is trouble okay so trouble and then i don't need the va and any other settings here let's set it to 36 and then let me write october i'm going to give you the color okay so you can check the color over here okay so let's check the color c13d04 c13d04 so once you copy you are good to go let's put in the color then let's change the font to the trouble font okay this is the font that we are going to do let's enlarge it now let's go and pick 60 which i think is okay let's pick 65 yes absolutely beautiful and then let me resize it this way and then let me resize the image a little bit which is okay now this is the magic so once yes let's align the october okay then copy the october then bring the copy under the image okay and then the one on top of the image in the layer side reduce or set the fill to zero okay and go to 
your fx and then go to stroke and we are going to give it a stroke color of white you can click on the color here change it to white and then give the size one okay which is i think okay then hold that off the the one that you gave it fx the first one then press on alternate and try to enlarge it or try to um, increase the font try to increase the font small okay so something like this so you see the magic yes so let's let's go ahead and increase i think i think this this is okay very good then let's select the two and then bring it down a little bit so you can see from here yes so that is absolutely beautiful you can even select all the two and increase the size of the font if you want to okay so i think this is okay for me let me bring it down a little bit and let me resize the image okay so i think resizing it i think this this is okay okay then we are going to select this then let me check the size of the happy new month okay i want you to be okay so this is the name of the font byzantium 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 okay so let's check that one um, of course i'm going to give you the font as well happy happy new month okay and let's resize it to 10 which i think is not bad okay so uh, let's pick yeah let's bring it here so let me pick 14 i think 14 is okay so this is beautiful and then this here is going to be your church logo okay so let me put here church logo or logo anyhow you want to call it let me change it to black okay so here is going to be your church logo or logo it could be your business logo it could be your church logo anyhow you want to put it and then if the church has social media handles you can see from here so i'm going to copy the handles okay here is it i've showed you how to copy so you select all the layers or the layers that you want to copy come to layer come to duplicate layer and then select so i want to move it to october and press ok and here we go you have it here beautiful and that is it so you have your handles placed right here for you so the next thing that we are going to do is to bring out the beauty okay of the work so i'll click um, on the size and then go to my resources and then we are going to import or bring in this lens flare okay we are going to bring in this particular lens flare or better still let's add a layer okay and then go and select your brush to change the foreground color from white and then let's pick any of the colors here and position it here and then let's reduce the size let's bring it up a little bit increase the size and then just make a click okay and then this is what you are going to change to that of screen okay that is the first one copy this ctrl j and then bring this one to here copy this one and we are bringing it closer to this so here we are going to reduce it okay reduce it and then bring it somewhere here which is absolutely beautiful let's copy it again and this time around i'm bringing it here and over here i'm going to um control u means huge or saturation and i'm going to play along with that of the yes the color okay so something like this is okay so let me position it here which i think is good i like what i'm seeing okay yeah so so this is it so the beauty of the work is so you can go ahead and press on ctrl j again just to bring out the 
the beauty of the work so you see so that is it that is it so you can have this as your um, church for for your church and it will look nice so that is it that is it so this is the end of the video very simple and very catchy okay so you can do this now one thing that i did for this particular design is that i added what we called a quote so you can add a quote here do not be anxious about anything but in every situation by prayer and petition with thanksgiving present your request to god that's philippians chapter 4 verse 6 so you can just come here and then put your quotes somewhere here so let me bring it here okay let me select the control j and bring it here okay so let me select the church okay all right so this is going to be your quote okay put your quote here all right so put your quote here that is it you can put your quote here that is if you want to put it you can just put your quote here and when you are done as usual you know how to save your work you go to file export and then go to export as so let me close this so that you can have a beautiful look at our work then let me change from transparent to that of the yeah and then let me export and don't forget that we are exporting it to desktop okay so let's go back to desktop and have a look at our work very beautiful and simple design so here is it october double click it and that is it this is the flyer that we just did amazing so one thing that i want you to keep in mind is that when you are designing just be creative think about what particular design that you want to do okay so if you look at the image over there i made the image depict because i am designing it for a church so you have to think through and then came out with this particular picture all right so i'll end my video here don't forget to like drop your comments and then please recommend somebody to come and watch this video thank you so much for subscribing and supporting this channel bye